Look how he demonstrates the fadeaway shot. <laughs> what what the fuck is this, Hanamichi, bro? This is what I said. The type of fouls Hanamichi is giving you, I ain't gonna lie. He testing you as a man, bro. Because it's like, bro, what you trying to do? What's up? It's a fake pass. I told you it's a fake pass. The big game. Chohoku versus Shoyo is about to start. So let's, let's get back to the match. Let's get it. We are on episode 37 of Slam Dunk. Let's get right into it as you can. As you just heard, we're going to be seeing Shohoku face off against Shoyo. The starting member. The starting member. Must be on Shoyo team. Hanamichi's in the starting lineup. What is the coach thinking? Have they given up the game already? Man, his friends are such haters. Let's just get the game won and think about the next stage later. And remember that this year, we're going to be the number one team. Is that guy over there really the Shuyo coach? He doesn't look like a coach at all, if you ask me. Well, man, you could say the same thing about Shohoku's coach. Don't look like he could be a coach too, man. The real coach is that one. He's also a member of the team, Kenji Fujima. Point guard. They say he's the coach. Okay. On court coach. Oh, the guys that was talking in the bathroom. I'm not gonna allow him to score more than five points today. What the? Number six. Hey, number six. You won't let me get more than five points? I'd like to see you try and stop me. Ooh, talk your talk, Miss Sui. <laughs> Yeah, sure. They show the supports. They came deep. Jahoku have never played a team with that much support before. It's gonna yeah. be tough for them. They got like two, three sections. Get all the rebounds. Okay. And don't foul. He keeps missing that. Finally said it. Come on, Akai, get the tip. Good shit. Hadamichi. What did he do? That's a jump violation. Foul. White number four. Oh, bro. I thought it was Hadamichi. Yo, they got us. I thought it was a foul. Of I was like, bro, now they just targeted him. It's not normal for Takanori to make such a simple mistake. If Shihoku can't keep themselves under control, they're gonna lose this game. I wonder why the coach decided to use Hanamichi at the beginning of the game instead of an older, more mature player. Yeah, I was wondering. Enough to play against Shoyo. I reckon Hanamichi's gonna do a good job, and I'm sure the coach knows exactly what he's doing. I gotta check this. We don't want to hear your voice. <laughs> right. The, he be meat right in every episode. He never fails to glaze. Oh. Was I hearing things, bro? I swore last episode they said Shoyo team was like small. They only got like two or three big guys. Oh, he's huge. Darn. Every single one of their players is taller than ours except for Takanori. Wow. Okay, so this is a big team they're playing. This is going to be very interesting. They're going to have to outrun them. They're going to have to be quick. Tie them out. And if you're going to drive into Pan Riota, do not drive unless you wide open. You like Nate Robinson out there with these towers. Hmm. We've never played a team with such tall players before. I wonder what's going to happen today. What? Is that a lob? Oh, oh I was finna say. That was a nice pass. Bro. The guy on the Shihoku that got the glasses, I don't know. When I see him with the ball, I'm just like, pass it, bro. But I'm seeing this guy, Shoyo, with the glasses. He looking like a formidable threat. He gonna pass out? 
What? Bro, what the fuck? Akagi went to try to hit it. He pulled it back. He still he was still informed, but he just pulled it back. What the fuck? I've never seen nothing like that. Akagi is coming to swipe that. He here, he here to swipe that bitch. And look what happened. Look, he pulls the ball back. So Akagi already misses that shit. That's 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 fucking amazing awareness. I, I but I've just never seen a person do that. Like he gonna make that shot too. I already know he gonna make it. He did a fadeaway. Oh yeah, he gave Akagi a fadeaway. He he gave Akagi a fadeaway shot. The way he's falling back, that shit look like a fadeaway. That was a tough shot too. So that you avoid the <laughs> oh my gosh y'all gotta see how this dude visually bro look how this dude visually showed the fadeaway shot First, <laughs> boy that shit was weak as fuck man. that was a weak ass fadeaway demonstration that shit was fucking hilarious How Narichi always does this, bro? He's just doing his job and scoring a point. And then out of nowhere, out of the shadows, Hanamichi comes and threatens that person. I'm gonna shut you down. Just you wait and see. Huh? <laughs> Doesn't even acknowledge Hanamichi. I was talking to you. He's gonna get a tech. Chill out. You gotta get back at him, Akagi. And then there's Uizumi from my team. We'll soon find out which one is the best center out of all three of them. Which one is the best center? Shoyo have to be the tallest high school team in the whole country. Dang. They gonna steal that. I'm telling you. One thing about playing with, against a tall team, bro, they got that length. So they gonna be able to reach out in the passing lanes, block shots. See what I mean? They can't pass overhead. My turn. Oh, don't foul. Not to allow your opponents to get past you. You need to get stay in front of them. Come on, honey, you stay in front of him. Hanamichi, what what the fuck is this, Hanamichi? Bro? What the fuck is this? You laid out the plan for the ball game. The last thing you uttered was no fouls. And here, you giving this man a karate chop to his fucking arm. Wrong sport. Hey, bro, this get this might give him his first flagrant foul. Man, look at old dude. He looking like, bro, what what the fuck is wrong with this red hair dude? This is what I said. The type of fouls Hanamichi is giving you, I ain't gonna lie. He testing you as a man, bro. Cause it's like, bro, what you trying to do? What's up? Like you trying to fight, bro? Cause you you ain't trying to hoop. Oh, man, not again. That was just a reflex move. Foul from white number ten. <laughs> Come on, Captain. All you have to do is keep your cool. We've been playing basketball together since junior high, and I think I know you pretty well by now. Flashback. Practicing so hard all the time. Everyone else went home ages ago. What are you talking about? If we don't practice hard, how are we going to take Shohoku to the national game? We're not going anywhere without Mitsui. Yeah, why don't you practice on your own, Takadori? Come back here! To me, Takadori! Now it's our last chance. Oh my gosh, this this music is banging right now. Please, somebody tell me the name of this instrumental. We may both be able to realize our dream at last. If they putting in that work. Go to the finals. We'll have a chance of playing in the national tournament. This is our last chance, Takadori. Yeah, they seniors. We have to do the best that we can. I'll stop him this time. Just see if I don't. 
Let's see if Akagi is going to be able to stop Kaga. Oh, he's going to pass. It's a fake pass. Fake pass. It's a fake pass. I told you it's a fake pass. How did, bro, that was the oldest trick in the book. Oh, he making that. He did a Kareem hook shot. This guy is going crazy. Hanagata, bro. This guy is fucking something else. He might be the best center. Because he, he's like the only center, at least that I've seen so far, display skills. Uizumi and Akagi, I feel like more like force present type of centers. Like they, it's not like skill type of, like Hanakata, Han Hanagata, he's been showing some skill type of plays as a big man. This is going to turn out to be a battle of the centers. Akagi. Ak can't manage to keep Hanagata under control. Then it's all over. Yeah, game over. And I'm afraid this will become a very one-sided battle. It's gonna be Shoyo's year, and we're gonna go all the way to the top. The Kagi pissed. <laughs> He's showing a Kagi up. Shohoku don't seem to be playing as well as they have done in previous matches. So what's gonna happen next? Damn, the whole team is sweating bullets. Whole team look the whole team looks shoot. Alright, this was episode 37 of Slam Dunk. Long awaited. The difficult battle that I've been waiting for Shohoku to play because Shohoku have been blowing out team as a team to team. And this team that they're playing Shoyo is not there are no joke. In the beginning of the episode, I thought I could have sworn last episode they said that Shoyo was the smallest team, but no, Shoyo is one of the biggest teams in the tournament, bro. You got to see Hana Hanagata versus Akagi was the battle of the centers. And uh, Hanagata, he was showing Akagi up. I'm not going to lie. He was showing Akagi up. And um, like I said, it's going to be... Han Hanagata, he's more of a skillful center, like I said. um, And he, like I said, he was giving the best to Akagi. Akagi was kind of getting frustrated because he couldn't stop it. He even fell for the fake pass. Hanagata did a fucking... He did a fucking Kareem hook. Bro did... A fadeaway shot as a big man. Yo, this man was... He was pulling out all the moves in this episode. But this just tells me next episode, I know Kagi's going to come up with a plan. I say they should double team him, trap him, get the balls out of his hand. Because he's too skillful as a center, bro. But we're going to see what happens moving forward. Hanamichi has not scored yet. He's already giving you one crazy physical foul. Like, I... I, I'm not surprised. I'm pretty sure he's going to do another one next episode. But yeah, this was episode 37. It was a good, fun episode. If you guys did enjoy my reaction, please leave a like. I really do appreciate it. And until the next slam dunk reaction, I am saying thoughts. It's the same life. I'm out, bro. I love y'all.